agreement that this is a great horse. He certainly is one of the outstanding uh, paces to come along in many, many a year. Do you do something different with him than you might do with an ordinary horse? Well, I guess that you could say I give him a little extra care than the other ones, you know. I've had him for about four years, and we kind of get along together real good. So, you know, I like to spend as much time with him as possible. How has he changed in those four years? Well, he's grown a lot, you know, and he's matured so much. He's still a little bit of a baby, but, you know, he's developed into a you know, great-looking and a great-mannered horse. Originally, he used to be rigged with all of this white rigging that his mother, uh, Robin Dundee, used. How come that was changed? Well, the harness, you know, after being used for so long, it just started to fall apart, and, you know, we just decided to put a regular harness on. No really main reason for it. In other words, uh, Genghis here didn't complain about that. No. <laughs> if, I, if I asked him that, what would he say? Genghis, any thoughts? <laughs> As you can see, Genghis uh, probably would have liked our uh, microphone. <laughs> Does uh, Genghis like any special treats? Oh, yeah. He loves carrots and things like sugar and carrots, but his carrots are his favorite. He loves when people come and bring him carrots, you know. Does he act any different after he's won a race? Oh, yeah. He's, he gets real cocky, you know, and thinks who he is, and he's just really hard to handle. He's one of the toughest horses. Like, after a race, most horses, they get real, you know, lo you know quiet and everything, but he just gets more rammy and more you know, full of pep. In other words, he knows when he wins. He knows, definitely. <laughs> okay. Okay, thank you very much, Ted.